My name is Rachel Martin and I am a member of the USA Shooting National Team. I'm working towards the podium in Tokyo 2020. Help me by getting there by supporting America's shooting team. Uh, I got involved when I was eight years old. My dad started coaching the 4 H shooting team and nobody was coming to practice and um, so that was kind of discouraging. So he made me and my two sisters go and we kind of just started the 4 H team in our county and I hated it at first, absolutely hated it. And then I was about 13, I'd been doing it for five years and something just kind of clicked. I think I liked it because it was really hard for me and I love that challenge. Uh, so that was kind of how I started. It's not like the typical story. I was actually really into like ballet and swimming and my dream was to be an Olympic swimmer um, or an Olympic ice skater. That's, that was my thing. Um, but now that I'm pursuing this, it's, I'm still pursuing the Olympics but in an avenue that I never thought that I would and that's really thanks to my dad. In order to pursue this Olympic dream, there's been a lot of sacrifices in terms of you know, when I graduated, a lot of people were like, you need to start a career, or you should get married, or you should do this, and, and I didn't do any of those things. Um, I kept shooting and kept with this dream, and there's always mixed opinions about that. Everybody's gonna have an opinion about that. Um, but I've had to, you know, I've put a career on hold, which means I've put an income on hold, and it's difficult to balance that here because I dedicate my time to the range. I dedicate my time to bring in whatever income I can to you know, buy food and housing. Um, and then I dedicate my time to the gym, doing what I need to do there. So my days are full and it's, it is very mentally and emotionally exhausting. Um, so I have put a lot of things on hold for this and I wouldn't do it any differently but it is, it's trying every day. I know that I have to get up super early and I have to work throughout the whole day to get done what I need to get done. Um, my family has also given up a lot for me to do this. I love competing in general. I'm, it's just something that I love to do, but when I'm overseas and you have all these nations with the, the names of their countries on their backs, so you have Germany or China, and me walking into that range with the USA on my back is the best feeling I've ever had. Um, and I'm just filled with such pride because I would not ever want to compete for another nation. I love our nation and I think that it's just such an honor, I guess. Um, I've thought about that a lot. I've thought about what does it mean to compete for the United States and I think it's showing people who we are and I've always been very patriotic, my family is very patriotic and I never thought I would get to do this um, and I, I look at my teammates walk in the range and them representing the USA and them going out there and just doing an amazing job and that's what people see when they see the USA in international competition. They see the dedication, the hard work um, and ultimately they see greatness, and to be a part of that, I, I love, I absolutely love it.